Hey there guys, my name is Marcus and in this video I'm going to show you how you can use Toggle Track. Also, I will show you how you can use the Toggle extension for Chrome. Let's start. The first thing we are going to do, I will click here Try Toggle and I will click Toggle Track. Here I will go Log Out, try it for free and I will agree to the terms and service and I will sign up with our email. Now I will just add, add here my mail and I will add my password. Sign up. Right when I got it, it's redirecting. And here we are. Here's the beauty. So, first, we are going on the left side. Just ignore this, we will get to it and how it works. First, you will have in Analyze, Reports and Insight. We will get to it after we finish sometimes. Then we have Projects, Clients, Theme, Tags, Settings and Help. And you can click Show More and have a subscription here. We can import, export and have a desktop app or mobile app. And then on the right bottom, you're going to see workspace and you can add a new workspace. So let's say that you have workspace for one client, then you can have workspace for a separate like project or client. It's really up to you. Now, when I'm going to click clients here, I can go to top right, click new client. Let's start with the clients. Then we'll go with the projects. You can also add tags and then we will go straight to the timer. New client. I'm going to add a new client like Jessica. Create. So here we got the client, I can edit it or delete it. Then let's click to projects. In projects, I can go again to top right, new project. And right here, I'm going to add a project name, YouTube channel. And I can simply choose the client, Jessica, and I can create a project. Right here, I have the project. When I'm going to open it, I'm the manager here and all members here. You can see and you can simply add the members to it. And you can edit the project in the top right. Again, you can edit as a private or no, or you can delete it or archive the project. So this is how you can create a project. Then you can add theme and you can simply invite members again in the top right. You have members directly here. Then you got like groups here, a group of your members and activity of members. Then you have tags and you can simply add a new tag. Let's go tag name YouTube create and then you got settings here where you can set up everything with a profile or with the import with the integrations etc so let's go to timer and right here let's start our timer what are you working on i'm going to write here youtube youtube channel project jessica that we created okay and now i can Okay, let's just choose bill rates, start starter feature. So you need to have like, if you wanted to have a billable, you need to have a starter feature. Then I can choose the tags here and I can see also the projects here. So I'll just add here again, my YouTube channel, directly connected it and voila, it's starting counting the entry. Now we can just wait for like one minute, two minutes until we're gonna have like whatever work you want to have done, like two hours, stop. Or what you can do is when you go to the top right, you're gonna see manual mode. Let's say that you're working one hour today. So what I'm going to do, it's 317. I can go, okay, 270 PM to 317. And I'm going to add a YouTube channel, Jessica, and click add time to entry and also tag one. So voila, here we get it. So today I got 217 to 317. Nice. And now when I would go, I can go to reports and I see it right here. This week, total one hour and clocked hours, one hour right here. And then you can inside here, I need to upgrade to have that. But this is pretty much it. Then you go like detail here and you see what was happening. So yeah, also you got extension. And I'm going to add it to Chrome, add extension. And now voila, I will just add here YouTube. I will just need to log in.
Is it the right password? I don't know what was happening. But again, you just come here. And you just add here your project and you start working on it. And you can simply open the toggle. And now, right now, I'm working. So this is pretty much it, how it works. So yeah, if you have any questions, guys, ask me down in the comments. I'm really happy to help you. You just edit here, you just write it, and you can go to settings and set up everything. So yeah, Togo is a really simple application. I don't know what else would I like say about it. I definitely recommend what it likes, like in my opinion, that you can go also with the Togo tracking. So that's another Togo planning, sorry. Planning. So let's say sign up and I recommend definitely planning with, with your tracking. You definitely need that. And again, when you would come here, you see it here. So you see the planning and you can simply add a task and you can add a task name here as this is a task status you can change in progress block done you can add a plan if it's going to be no plan assigning when you have a team you can add multiple assignees you can add people and other properties like segments again you can add like if you have multiple segments or youtube channels if i would have a youtube project you can repeat it, you can add daily estimate and start an end time when it's going to start and when it's going to end. And then you can also add an item. So this is how you create a task and voila, here we have it, right? So here are the tasks. You can simply add multiple ones if you want to. And then in the left, you're gonna see my profile and you can edit and play around it. But again, I would possibly go with a, not toggle planning, but with something else, uh, like, I don't know, Asana Trello and combine. So, yep. You can add also boards and timeline. Let's go with YouTube channel. But again, you can combine it if you want to, but I'm used to those. But if you prefer to use toggle planning with toggle, uh, toggle track, you can do it, but you're gonna pay for toggle plan. You get 14 day free trial. And you would go here. Pricing. You sit here. Monthly, but you're gonna see the recurrent task, multi assigned task, file upload to 100 megabytes. You have to pay. But yes, you get a free account. But really good things and toggle track integration can be, be only in paid version that's what i actually mean with if so you got boards here you got timeline in boards i can simply go and add a task this is what i have to do and you can move it between in progress blocked etc and again in the same as i mentioned in the beginning you can simply edit everything here so this is how you can add plans plans are like projects what do you want to actually do and yeah, if you have any questions, guys, ask me down in the comments. I'll be really happy to help you and provide some guidance. This is how you can use Toggle. It's pretty simple. And yeah, have a great day and goodbye. See ya.